last... That was heavy. You watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. All right. Hey, about that other thing. You know, the score. Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can put in some trades of your own. Uh, I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, but maybe I'll take a look. Oh wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Forgot we're supposed to be first person. Let's see how far Lester is. Lester. Let's get let's get y'all some driving gameplay. Let's not just do taxis the whole time. Get us some talk radio. And make this drive. Oh, oh, that sucks. Sorry, my bad. Someone asked me. I think they were on Twitter. <clears throat> Someone asked, "Is it harder to drive in GTA, first person, or in real life?" <laughs> Just so y'all know, I don't drive nothing like this in real life. I'm actually a pretty good driver in real life. So yeah, definitely easier to drive in real life. Listen, I feel for you. I'm very sorry, to, I mean, woman. So much easier to drive with Franklin, man. When I could uh, slow things down. Move, man. What are y'all doing? Let's get to our first guest. Please welcome to the Fernando Show gubernatorial candidate, former teacher, and successful divorcee, Sue Murray. Sue, come on in. Sit down. Good to meet you. This show moves us like Eskimo people. Uh, good to meet you. I'm are y'all listening to this talk radio stuff? Better at this driving now. I take everyone with me. I take all of the women of San Andreas with me. They'll all be governors if I am. That's how I want everyone to think of it. A door breaking through. How the heck do I get over there? And so everybody is menstruating at the same. <clears throat> time. This is a problem. Well, it's <coughs> is that a coke in there? Listen, I've done a little a holder lot of thinking, and I've realized the only way for women to move forward is if we all start to think in exactly the same way. Ah, crap. Listen, women finally need to make it through the door of the state capitol. You are probably just going to spend a lot of money redecorating and looking through catalogs. The hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail, the Union Depository. Now they say it cannot be hit. Has it been yet? Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh. I met him, he was charming. 
<laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Well, gem as it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, he went quiet. <laughs> all right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too <coughs> unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. We're going to Little Portola. You're a really bad driver! Shut up, your FIB like buddies, you. they uh, know you're back in business. FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. But for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. Well, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident. The shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Are we robbing already? I don't remember this. Here we are. Ah, oh, we're scoping the place. pick up a little something for the woman in my life. Well, one of them. <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. This ain't my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe... 10 grand? Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelico logo here? <laughs> No, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around. Think about it. Come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Come back to me. Have a wonderful day. What's happening? So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. I'll see where the ventilation comes out. That was so unnecessary. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Drive around the block and look for a way up to the roof.
Look, there. Some construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. So, you keep up with the old crew? You know, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I kept tabs on him for a while, needed to, uh, know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. He's probably a John Doe then, right? What do you think? OD? Shootout? Maybe just a car crash, right? Anonymous charred remains on the highway? They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. I'm on the roof! I need to know where the air coming out of those vents in Vangelico originates. There should be a unit above the store. Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? I've pulled up a satellite image. It looks like the highest point is on the northwest side. Get a shot from there. What does that mean? I was about to say, you better put some on my radar. It's like a big box on the roof. You've got a good vantage. Now use it and get an image of the air system. That's it. Take the shot and we're finished. We've got our shot of the Vangelico unit. Looks good. Okay, that'll do. Now come back to me before someone spots you up there. Will do. Uh, how do I get back without dying? Uh. <coughs> what if I could just jump off, man? I wonder if I'll survive. Mm. No, I don't think that's too likely. Let's hurry this up, Michael. Shut up. Oh, I guess I could jump from there. What the heck was that? Why you scream like that? You scream like someone's playing with your booty hole, man. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told them to start setting up the information. <laughs> Yo, that scream, though. So, what did you see? Nothing that'll cause... My bad, my bad. Undo complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Camera. Broadcasting to a remote server. We might be able to wipe them remotely. Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes and rub his nose in it. Uh, good. The alarm system's linked to the door. We'll get a good window. Someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store. By the register. So I'd start there. The glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof, means you can smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open then. Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, <coughs> man. Those vents look promising. Uh, might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. <laughs> Park job was a little bit off. It's cool. Here are the photos. Uh, workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. 
All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't want to leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right. Not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options, you know, showing you all the angles, that's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that is your domain, my friend. Here. And there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. That means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LSPD tactical teams, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the L.S. River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? We're gonna go loud this time because we did stealth on our last playthrough. Ah, still a hothead? Well, some things never change. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Eddie Cho. Now well, you can count on him to get you out of a spot. Guns. Yeah, it might be hot and heavy in there. This guy will keep it from going bad. Gus Moda. He's a pro. Not much else to say. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. Harris! <laughs> Good. Feminine touch. She'll be able to find any back doors they got. If this is how you want to do it, I'll get moving. That'll do it. Okay. I I'll look into how you can find a tack team and get their weapons, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good. Good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa. What? My rep don't count for nothing no more? <coughs> You're a dead man, man. I'll call you.